Okay, Liz Williams, Pine and Oak Direct of Ruthin, North Wales. I'm on cohort nine and enjoying it. What impact did the Lead Wales programme have on your business? I'm finding that it makes me look in depth at a lot of our activities, um, especially marketing and especially um, it's made me look at where to posture in the market and um, instead of looking at being price conscious all the time, it's made me look more to quality conscious and so I'm garnering quite a different client base so that's helped and also there have been some oh, extremely interesting marketeers and um, especially some of the master classes have been marketing, marketing, marketing and really there's been a lot to gather out of that. What advice would you give to other people that are thinking of joining the Lead Wales programme? Oh, I would say that if you want to grow your business and you really um, value your skills as a leader, you owe it yourself to see if you can get on it because you get the type of encouragement and also a lot of interaction with your um, fellow students which I think are invaluable in the marketplace today. Have you or your business changed within the last 12 months? Yes, it has. Um, like most other people in retail, uh, we suffered um, at the time of recession and tried to hold on to most of our jobs, which fortunately we did. But of course, turnover was down. And also, um, in retail, we all um, have the internet to cope with and the amazing Amazon, who sell everything. So. Um, being on the lead, um, it's made uh, me ask myself a lot of questions about pushing turnover up and also with the quality element comes a higher priced product and um, uh, well, one of the masterclasses particularly was all about don't be scared of climbing up the market and uh, get a wider vision and I think that's quite important. Do you spend more or less time in the business since graduating? I do spend less because everybody natters at you if you don't do your time away and spend time um, working on the business. And strangely enough, I have a lot of relations who are in business of their own and two who are fabulous florists. And now we phone each other and say, have you been working on the business all week? And um, so this has kind of got a knock-on effect on a lot of people. Do you meet up um, or do you meet with people socially um, or outside yes, of the um, programme? I haven't met up an awful lot, but I've got quite a lot uh, out of the uh, shadowing experience. And um, yes, and I'm going to meet someone else again. So yes, and that is a nice element too that wouldn't have happened without feed.